Hi YouTubers, Old Radio Al here. You're looking at a Bendix clock radio. It's a model uh, 753F. It's called uh, the Cascade. And there were a couple of other models, the 753M, which was the Marion, and the 753W, which was the uh, the Bedford. The only difference in them being the cabinet finish. This radio is from 1953. It's a rather large radio for being a clock radio. I know there were smaller clock radios by that time, but I really like this one. It keeps perfect time. Can't take any credit for that. All I did was some uh, cleaning and lubrication on the clock. I did uh, recap the radio. It's another All-American 5. And yes, this radio does sit at my bedside. Kind of big, but I like it. Bendix was, uh, as you might guess, founded by a man named Bendix, Vincent Bendix, uh, back in uh, 1914. It was an auto parts company. As a matter of fact, uh, GM bought a a minority partnership uh, back in 1924, which is ironic because later Bendix made uh, car radios for Ford. Uh, let's see, back in 1929, Bendix expanded into avionics, aviation parts, and uh, the company was renamed Bendix Aviation. Uh, you might have read at some point they uh, they uh, sponsored a, a transcontinental plane air race. Uh, it's called the Bendix Cup for a lot of years. I think up until the early 60s. Uh, during World War II, about three quarters of all the avionics and American warplanes were uh, manufactured by Bendix. They didn't start making radios until immediately uh, post-war. And uh, I think Bendix ended up being a subsidiary company of someone else. I think they might still be around. Anyway, I thought I'd show you this clock radio after I learned a, that a good YouTube buddy is not only a radio hobbyist, he was a, 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 a clock professional, clocksmith or clockmaker, whatever you'd call him. So let's give a listen to this 1953 Bendix called the Cascade. I'd show you the chassis but there's not much to see. It's uh, covered by a loop antenna. The on-off switch is, is right here for the radio and they had a uh, an outlet for plugging a lamp or some other type of appliance in and it's non-polarized of course no longer useful. Speakers on the side and the clock face it says right right on it, as you can see, Bendix Aviation Corporation. So let's give it a listen. You taught me
another radio that's clearly not a portable with a handle on it. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, more radios on the way. A couple more clocks too, including a, a Philco clock. Thanks for watching.